My second game of today. Age of Mythology Retold. Command the gods and monsters of legend in Age of Mythology Retold become mythic on an epic scale. Yes, gamers, middle-aged gamers, you remember Age of Mythology from way back when, right? And, and honestly, this is one of the games where I think I would have been in high school about that time. And I had been playing Age of Empires and I didn't end up playing this. I would have played something else at that point. And I'm like, oh, okay. And I saw this, I'm like, this is really cool. And I looked at the trailer, I'm like, hopefully this is better than the other sort of Age of Empires remastered, but it looks really nice. Like, it's like that Age of Empires 4 engine, Age of Mythology in the Age of Empires 4 engine, which is what really impressed me. So it's pretty amazing. It's published by Xbox Game Studios, which is surprising, like why Microsoft published Age of Empires 4, maybe that would change its structure. So again, you can pre-purchase it starting at Roughly, and again, caveat on the prices, about 25, roughly about 27, 28 US dollars, all the way up to a premium edition, which is like a 55 US dollars roughly or so. It's not safe, usually with a pre order price, there's a date, it just is coming 2024. It looks pretty much done, just looking at the trailers, looking at what people have said and blah. But I would imagine I'm like 80% confident this game is going to come out at some point this year. When that is, is another story. But yeah, if you've never heard of the Age of Mythology series, you could imagine an Age of Empire theme. I did play the original one a little bit, not a huge amount, but you can imagine Age of Empires, but you get all these sort of non historically aligned, aligned powers, like the power of Zeus and the power of this god and the power of that god, which makes things fun and more interesting and different. I always felt like Age of Empires, my older brother always put sort of strategy games in this genre. It's just like a rock, paper, scissors approach. And I felt like this sort of allowed a little bit of, of a difference, but yeah. So what, what is this game about? Uh, choose your gods from Greek, Norse, Egyptian, and Atlantean pantheons. Devastate enemies by summoning powerful lightning storms, earth shattering quakes, unleash monsters, and an epic mythological universe. Play with friends. And, and again, this is not new. This is exactly what happened with Age of Empires 4, where you can play with your friends, you can play co-op versus the AI. There's going to be some sort of multiplayer matchmaking system as well. And again, being a corporation, if you do pre-purchase the game, you get to start early, seven days ahead. That's something to take into account as well as maybe if you are going to play multiplayer and you don't pre-purchase it and you're waiting to buy it later, you're going to be like behind at least seven days to the people who have pre-purchased the game. So whether that leaves something in the back of your throat. That's another story, but this looks amazing. This is something I want to play. I'm hoping it comes to Mac or PC as well as the second stage. I just bought some strategy games on the recent Steam sale, but yeah, if you played Age of Mythology back in the day when us middle-aged gamers were trying to finish high school, what do you think? Are you excited about Retold? Please let us know down in the comments and don't forget to check out other games we've talked about right 